Hey everyone, today I am making four painted rocks for you. First one up is this cute little cloud with a rainbow. The first thing I did was take white paint and paint the cloud. And then once I was done with that, I started with purple and went all the way up to red, all the way around the rock. On a few of the colors like purple and I believe yellow, I had to do a couple of coats, which I did not show you on here, but I wanted to let you know if you need to do more coats, you're more than welcome to do that. Now I'm just taking some gray and outlining so that way you can see that it is a cloud and then I'm just adding some eyes, a mouth, and pink for the cheeks just to make it look cute and as she's blushing. Now I am just taking a thin brush and painting on some black lines so that way it makes the colors pop. Isn't she so cute? Okay, next up we're doing a simple pineapple. First thing you're gonna do is just kinda do the shape of a pineapple in yellow and then you're gonna do green for the leaves and then once that dries, I had to do the yellow three times because of the coloring. And then I just take some gold and do an outline and then just do stripes across and the opposite way. Next up is this cute little ladybug. The first thing I do is take the red paint and paint the whole rock. Once I have done the red, I am now going to paint the black face and then I'm going to make a black line straight down and also make the polka dots. Now to add some extra cuteness, I just add some eyes and then did some white polka dots as the antennas and then took a little bit of blue for the rest of the eyes. Last but not least, Pac-Man. Who doesn't love Pac-Man? So the first thing I did was I painted the rock black and then I took some blue and made some squares and then I took yellow and made polka dots, you know, the little food that he eats. Now of course you have to add Pac-Man to the group and then I added some cherries, a strawberry, and of course the little ghosts that are trying to eat the Pac-Man. Once you are done with all of your rocks, you're just going to take some Mod Podge and seal your rocks so that way when it rains or anything like that, it does not take the paint off. 
and sometimes it may just depending on how good your weather is in your state or area. And that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and let me know what kind of rocks you paint. Thanks, guys. Bye.